What's up everyone, we're at the Star Wars booth here at the San Diego Convention Center. And just look at behind me, we have all these costumes from the Star Wars TV series on Disney Plus. Going back from the Book of Boba Fett, to Mandalorian, to the recently ended Obi-Wan Kenobi series. We have Obi-Wan himself up there, Darth Vader's costume that Hayden Christensen wore. And what's really exciting, what gets me excited, is the upcoming Andor series that's launching on August 31st on Disney Plus. We have Cassie and Andor's costume there, and also the legendary Mon Mothma. But that's not all you can see here at the Star Wars booth. They're showing clips from some of the episodes and films and from the Star Wars universe. They also have a really cool action figure set over at the Hasbro booth over here, Star Wars Hasbro. There's a Darth Vader Infinities action figure that's white. It is clean, bro. You gotta pick that one up. I don't know how much it costs. Probably not cheap, but it looks really cool. So I don't wanna forget to mention, there's this awesome 3D puzzle company called Puzz, and you can put together X-Wings, BB-8, it looks almost like Legos, but it's like you got this figure that you put together, you can build at home, really cool. And now we're here at the Hasbro section talking with Chris Reif here about the Star Wars, the Black Series lightsaber collection. These just look fantastic. I want to know the details, how these things work, what's going on here. Chris, what can you show us? All right, well, so this is our, our Obi-Wan Kenobi FX Elite lightsaber from the new series. It's, it, these things are just amazing. They're packed with tech. They've got, well, I'll turn it on here. We've got progressive ignition blades. So all the great sound effects. It's got all the sounds from the show, all the different unique things. All the, it's a little loud and hard to hear in here, but like it, it's got all the, the noises specific to it. It's, it's got, when it gets hit, it, it lights up, does stuff. It's got all these different little features. So we can do this. Like you've got two lightsabers crossed and holding them into each other. So cool stuff that way. It's got a little blaster to flex, like you're blocking stuff from stormtroopers. Um, it's got, if I turn it this way, it's got this wall cut feature, like you're cutting into something. So, um, it, and then on top of all that, it's got a removable blade. So you can turn it off here, spin this top off on it. And then I can pop the blade out of the thing. And I'll, I'll just throw this down here on the ground. Um, but then I've got a whole second top on it that I can put in here. And this top has much skinnier neck on it. So it's much more accurate to the visuals of the prop itself. So if you want to display it without the blade on a little stand that it comes with, then you can put this top on it and it looks just like the thing or hang it on your belt or whatever you want to do. I know Darksaber was also from, you know, the you know the animated Star Wars series as well. Do you talk to any of the, the higher ups over at Lucasfilm, like a Dave Filoni or anybody that kind of talks to you when you show sudden this, this design or anything? Do they see any of this? Oh, they, they have. And actually, a funny story with the Darksaber, uh, John Favreau came and visited our offices at one point and was marveling over the Darksaber and just how hard it was for them to get all the tech in the thing for the, the on-set one to make it work right and, and have around for, for filming. And then seeing ours in person, just marveling at you guys managed to do this in, a, in an actual product. So yeah, it was fun. And can uh, I'm sure everybody wants to know, can we get these? Are, are they available? When are they going to be out? Yeah, so the, the Obi-1 is one of our latest. It's available for pre-order right now on HasbroPulse.com. It will ship, I think, later this fall. And then the others are, are already out. So there's, there's these and plenty more. There's a Princess Leia one that's got some really great chrome finishes and pearlescent stuff going on. Chris, really appreciate you taking the time to talk about all these awesome lightsabers. Yeah, Thanks no so much. Problem. Thanks, guys. And that's all we have for you today. Keep it locked right here on IGN.